Hey yo, how to Friday here at Mindy Hebner Life on Purpose channel, place, IG. We're going to do installment two of words you get to ditch and words you get to incorporate instead. So the words that you get to ditch are words that can cause argument and resentment and make other people feel a certain kind of way, even though like we can't actually make someone feel a way they decide to feel that way. That's a whole nother how-to. I digress. Oh, the word that we're going to swap, we're going to do a little word swap today, and we're going to get rid of but, and we're going to swap in and. But, when we use but in a sentence, it tends to negate the sentence that came before it or sentences that came before it. Uh, I hear what you're saying, but, mm, but I really don't. Uh, that's a great idea, but. So think about when you're in conversation, brainstorming, having a heated conversation, even talking to, uh, you know, someone that you love anywhere, anytime you're having a conversation, when you can ditch the word, but, and then you can ditch resentment and locking something in place and not leaving room for space and substitute in the word and, and opens everything up and doesn't negate the words that came before, it still holds the space for them and says, we can move forward. That is a great idea. And I'd like to add this to it. I totally hear what you're saying. And I'm still upset. You insert the and anytime, but wants to come out and I'll even if it, it comes out rarely for me, I'm really good at catching myself now because I really like this swap. But, and when it comes out, if it comes out and I say, but I say, mm, I mean, and I just stop, I just erase it. Like I just go back and talk over it uh, so that it's clear that there's not a, but I'm not stopping. I'm not negating. I'm not trying to start an argument or limit the conversation at all. So, how to Friday, your new word is and, you're swapping out but, that big old but that causes a lot of problems, right? Can cause a lot of problems. I'm into your life on purpose coach. I want to know how you're loving these how to Fridays because the loop one got some serious fire from you guys. Like so many people said that closing the loops video, oh my gosh, like I didn't even realize how much I needed this. So if you can implement, try on, what would it look like? Just swapping out but for and and seeing the difference that it makes in your relationships and in your conversations. You're unlocking that magic, baby. Have a great Friday.